Hello and welcome back to the Rovers Chat YouTube channel. We're sitting down for a quick reaction as Rovers released the 23-24 away kit made by Matt Cron. It's a two-tone kit, as you'll see, a lovely model by Scott. Uh, it I believe it's described as graphite and cloud grey with silver detailing. We're just going to have a quick discussion about it, thoughts on it. You know, we did one to the home kit. You can check that out using the link below. But Scott, you're wearing it. What do you make of it? Well, I, I actually only made the decision this morning to actually go and get it. But um, yeah, I saw it and uh, it's it's lovely. It's uh, The detailing on it is much easier to see in person. You can't see it on the camera, but uh, you, can in, you can see it much clearer in real life. Um, a lot like other people that's been collecting on Twitter, like at first nobody knew what colour the, the Totally Wicked was. Was it blue? Was it white? Was it grey? And it is grey, but it, it's it's lovely. Yeah. Yeah, it looks, I'm a big fan of it, actually. I think, I know the home kit divided opinion, but the reaction to this seems to be seems to be very good. Whether we see Rovers wearing it a lot this year is a different story, given the way that last year's away kit were barely worn and we used the third one a lot, which are expecting to be yellow, aren't we? Uh, but hopefully we can make a lot of memories in it. Obviously you like it. Where do you think it ranks in terms of the away kits we've had previously? Is it up there with the best? I think it is, you know. As I actually said, you know, hoping to, I'm hoping to get the front of it signed by the squad in, in silver pen because I think that'll look really good. But um, but I said I'm at, later on in the season when they go a bit cheaper, I might just go and get another one just to keep wearing. <laughs> and all that's what I was thinking. It looks really good, doesn't it? And fingers crossed we make a lot of memories in it. I saw someone put on Twitter the other day that kits are kind of, you remember them because of how good they were, but you also remember if you've had a good year, you never want to remember a poor one. So it's like it's like it's like that it's like that yellow one that we used to have that I have. I love that yellow one. That's it. When it's a good year, people love it, don't they? But we'll uh, we'll see how it goes. Fingers crossed it's good. And of course, like I said, check out the reaction to the home kit down below, and you can also check out the reaction to the third one when that comes out. I believe it's next week, isn't it? Scott, final words on the kit. Give us your final thoughts on it since you've got it. Yeah, it's uh, it's really nice. It's I think you know for for anyone who's uh, I think you know the the Venkis badge on the sleeve looks it actually works in quite well with it as well with the the yellow ring. It look it it actually looks pretty decent. Have you got it? Have you got it on there? I've right? I've not got it. I've not got it. But um, it's an it's an additional two pound fifty if you want it. <laughs> I think we'll be avoiding it. Uh, that's where we're on, off. Thank you to everyone for watching. Really appreciate the support. Just a quick video there going over the kit. Like I said, the home one and the away and the third one. So you'll see reactions to as well. Plenty of content coming out. If you haven't seen already this week, we released a chat with Rich Sharp, Morton Gamps Pedersen. We brought a brand new podcast out. It's been a busy week, a really busy week. Check all them out. Hit subscribe. Hit the bell notification as well. You'll be, uplo you'll be notified every time we upload. And we'll see you soon for a new video. Thank you very much for watching.